Breaking news, uh, free speech attacked in Great Britain by arresting a man with a mobile phone. Uh, police attitude um to the bully case is that they're going to use their powers of arrest to stop um independent journalists and youtubers and tiktokers turning up at the scene of crimes and doing uh, any filming it seems it's okay for sky itv bbc oh channel four you name it they're there every newspaper they're all there it's fine but uh if somebody's going to go on social media and not toe the line Oh boy, you're going to be in trouble from now on. Do not go near a crime scene if you're going to speculate or not agree with the narrative. Poor old Curtis from Curtis Media has been arrested. He's the man from Killer Mister. Um, he's been seen all over the village of St. Michael's on Wild Course, and he's upset a few of the locals, and the police have decided now to arrest him for encroaching the scene of where the body was found. But I also remember Channel 4 being there, and maybe some others. So um, are they going to be arresting Channel 4 as well? So is it one rule for one, one rule for another, or did he actually break some laws that the other um, more reputable TV companies didn't? Well, he's definitely been arrested. Is this uh, to be made an example of? Is this going to happen in the future, at future events? If you take your mobile phone along and take some footage and it gets thrown to um, social media, are you liable for arrest? This is, needs to be sorted out because it's a game changer, ladies and gentlemen, it's a game changer. It means that independent voices are being silenced. My car's up there, mate. Yeah. My car's up there. Here? Yeah. Where's your car, sorry? At the end of the lane, mate, on the main road. Right, okay. I went for a walk in the countryside and I've come back this way. So you What's just going go, on? You're just going straight through. Straight to the car, mate, yeah. You can just go straight through. Yeah, yeah no worries. Yeah. Yeah. What's happened? Great. Close straight straight okay, fair enough. What it is, I, I came through a minute ago. Yeah, I know, I saw. My car's there, so I, 
I've obviously gone round, I've gone over the bridge without thinking I've gone over the river. Right. So I've gone all the way down there and the road goes off the river, doesn't it? It goes away. Right, okay. So I'm not I'm wrong side. Right, okay, mate. I don't mind waiting, so, but I need yeah, to Yeah, just for the time being, there's some cops on there, just mind waiting with them for the time being. I didn't reach right? them, that was far enough I got. Right, okay. <laughs> um I literally went down there about 10, 15 minutes, right. realised the road goes away from the river. It's but if I just go that road, I'm looking. Right. <laughs> I'm from Blackpool, not from, I am from round here, but not from this actual right, okay. local local, so. I appreciate so that. Just down here, there's some uh, more police officers. Yeah. You just wait. Yeah, you know, we're uh, behind them, mate. Yeah, sure, yeah, yeah. Make your way back round to your Okay. It's up, it's up to you. Yeah, I'm on either side. I'm by the right, school right. area. So I've come over the bridge. I've come along the river here. So what's that, mate? The main bridge road. Not, not too far, if I'm, if I'm honest with you. I'm not familiar with the area. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, what's going on down there? I'll walk down. They wouldn't let me pass. We've blocked all the road off. We've just been told to block it off. So if you just oh. go, if you keep going down, the road's blocked again, but they'll let you through. Okay. Bye. Yeah, no worries. Cheers. Breaking news, uh, free speech attacked in Great Britain by arresting a man with a mobile phone. I don't think everybody's at risk of being arrested for having a mobile phone, but this is just a warning how things have changed for free speech in Great Britain. Don't buy it. You can't trust second-hand information from a peddler of lies. Now you know something.